Hey everyone, welcome back to our Fallout 4 playthrough. Before we get started, make sure you guys go ahead and like the video and subscribe if you're new here. I hope you guys enjoyed yesterday's action-packed search for the railroad. Today, we're focused on leveling up, so we're going to be paying a visit to everyone's favorite, Preston Garvey, for some settlement assistance. Now, before we get started, make sure you guys head on over to our Twitch channel and drop a follow. I broadcast there several times a week and would love to hang out with you all over there. And while you're at it, go ahead and join our Discord commu our community Discord. We'd love to see you in there as well. And be sure to follow on all of our other social media. Everything's linked down in the description below. Now, let's get into some Fallout 4. All right, welcome back to the channel, guys. We are continuing our Fallout 4 playthrough. Uh... <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you guys seen the mole rat with the explosives attached to it, but uh, I don't remember that being a thing, so uh been long enough that since I've played that I don't even remember experiencing that, so that was uh, that was something. <laughs> oh, man. So uh, this last episode, we had discovered the railroad. What? What? Oh. We had discovered the railroad and uh, killed Swan and read about Swan a little bit. So today we are making our way over to... Oh, hey, some caps. We're making our way over to this settlement to start doing some settlement stuff. Basically, you know, uh, Preston is probably the most annoying NPC in terms of doing the uh, settlement stuff. But it's XP is how I look at it. So we're going to work on getting some experience by doing that. And uh, hopefully level up one or two more times. I'm going to sleep for an hour there so I can heal. There we go. And auto save, of course. And then, uh, but yeah, with, with doing that stuff... It should help us level up a little bit and we can just take our time and not to mention if you guys recall me talking about doing the achievement for Let's get this over with, shall we? oh Christ Ugh. doing the achievement to get the uh, settlements to a hundred percent so We'll slowly but surely chip away at that. That's probably going to take a while to do. Um, a long while to do that, but the best way to get started is to just go ahead, help these settlements, clear out the ghouls and crap that they're asking help for with. And Bye. God, she looks... Do do she trouble. looks angry. Jeez. Um, Minutemen? Didn't you ask the Minutemen for help? You're with the Minutemen? I didn't really think you fellas. We sent word oh, with one of them. I almost dropped my trailers, controller there. Sorry. I think I skipped some dialogue. Those people don't put much stock in the Minutemen these days after Quincy. Bad business that. Um. Well, Minutemen are back. We're rebuilding the Minutemen from the ground up. We're the good guys again. I got sucked it. into it. No question. <laughs> I didn't really have a choice. We're here. Pieces. There's a raider gang that's been giving us trouble for weeks, stealing food and supplies. Threatening to kill us all if we don't pony up. We know where they're so, coming from, but we can't go up against a gang like that. Um, I'll do it. Don't worry, I'll take care of those raiders for you. Thanks, friend. If you folks are for real, don't really have a choice. It'll be a welcome change <laughs> for the better. I got you. All right, how far away are they? Dang, they're like all the way over there at the pond. And you're worried about them all the way over here in the north, north, northern, like kind of northeast section of the map? Wow. That's pretty far out of your way to be concerned about these raiders. 
We got bunker or something over here. Oh no. Please hit it. Thank God. Oh God, go away. Go away! Oh. I cannot stand blood bugs. They are the worst. But also that one sting wings are pretty bad too. Sting wings are very bad. Oh, I might be able to get this. It's a novice. Alright, let's see if I remember how to do it, guys. It's been a few days. Alright, so let's see here. Start with rags. Oh, okay, that worked. Well, that was just that was just me guessing to just try to be like, okay, here's the first guess. Oh, that worked out. <laughs> He's not doing too hot. But then again, he was locked inside of there. Uh, I'm going to quick save. Huh. Is that a raider, you think? Oh, it is. Raider scum. That is definitely a raider scum. You're mine now, rookie. You're mine now, rookie. Shot you right in the booty hole. Think you can hide? No, I'm not trying to. Where are you at? Oh, there you are. Oh! Oh! I got ahead of the punch there. No? No? Okay. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> I think the blood bugs give that antiseptic. I need to start looting them whenever I'm done killing them. That is kind of a thing, like, as annoying as they are, they do drop some, their uh, guts are pretty useful. Got it. All right. I think that we explored this area a little earlier in our playthrough. So we, yeah, so we just got to be careful. We just didn't go in here. But yeah, this is where the Raider gang is apparently, so we just gotta take it a little easy while we're going through here. So this guy made sure he had everything he needed before starting his camping trip and that little possessed. Tweezing bear. Man, they got wrecked. Jeez.
taking that because it's probably useful. Hey, Tales of a Junk Down Jerky Vendor. Bingo. Uh, permanently gains better prices when buying from a vendor. Salisbury steak. Gotta take a little nap, you know, after killing everybody. That jet. That jet fix. Hi, Walter. Oh my god, this man's head kicked so far back, and then just... Yikes. Gift shop key. That's interesting that they these raiders have names. I wonder if you could, like, join them instead? I'm actually genuinely unsure. I mean, if you know and you're watching, you're more than welcome to put it down in the comment section. But there could also just be some lore in which, where they tie into maybe something we found or read, which is quite possible actually. I forgot I unfavorited this. I should have left my mini gun. I don't have ammo for it. So I don't really need it. Can't do anything with it. I got 17 bullets. With 5 mil. Nope, nothing else. Quick save. We're going to go into the gift shop. Um, overdue book. See, those are kind of like the uh, pre-war books from uh... Oh! Jeez! Uh, from Fallout 3, though. Yeah, the pre-war books from Fallout 3. You collect all of those. You get some... A lot of bottle caps. That's not what you get for it on here, but you can turn them in, and that's in better shape than I and uh, you turn them in, and you can get little different items, like useful items. Some of it's junk, some of it's really useful. Anything? Yes. Army fatigues, huh? Eh, nothing I'd use. Is that it? Oh, yeah, I guess that was it. We can go back and tell them we took care of those raiders. You sure managed to find your fair share of trouble, don't you? Oh, what's up? 
Um. I suppose so. Hey, I'm not one to judge. Honestly, it's just nice to not be doing it alone for a change. <laughs> In my line of work, things tend to get pretty hairy. I've been shot at, poisoned, nearly executed. Heck, until recently, they called the lockup in Diamond City the Piper Ooh. State. Anything for a story, yeah. I suppose. Exciting life. You've led an exciting life. Sure have. But honestly, now that I'm out here with you, I feel oh, like I'm just getting started. Whoa. Get in trouble. It's what folks like us do. I mean, you and I are Is Piper... Here. Low key flirting. So people in the Commonwealth can have a chance at a better life, not for praise or reward or glory, but because it's right. For glory. I just wanted to let you know. I'm real happy to be along for the ride. Hey. Oh. Um. I wouldn't want it any other way. I like having you close. All the Damn it. Watch each other's backs. So you want to get out of here? Yep. Disregard. <laughs> I knew you would help us. Hi. Hi, how are you? Yeah. <laughs> I just pushed me out of the way. He's like, get out of the way. We've been talking. We decided if you came through for us, we'd join up with the minute. We want things to get better. We've got to start helping each other. Yep. So we're in. You can count on us if you need help down the line. Oh, sick. Thanks again, friend. Sounds good. You're very welcome. All right, and then what do we do now? Talk to Preston Garvey. So, yeah. Today's just going to be a lot of this. Go talk to him. Tell him we helped this settlement. He's going to send us off to another settlement. Oh, you know, the rinse and repeat of helping settlements. Yeah, I'm going to, as much as I would like to use my minigun, I can't really use it because I don't have a lot of ammo for it. So, yeah. Oh, he's not in here. thought he was in here. Apparently not. Hello, Mr. Garvey. Stay sharp. Don't let your guard down. You know that settlement you sent me to help? They've decided to join the Minutemen. That's great news. I knew you were the right person for the Yeah, job. yeah. By the way, you should have one of these flare guns. You can use it to signal for help from any nearby minute. You know, I have you never. Have. But once we have more allied settlements, you'll have help whenever you need it. I don't think I ever told you what happened to the Minutemen. Uh, How I ended up as the last one. Sure. Not interested. Okay, I'm listening. I'm listening. Have you heard of the Quincy Massacre? Nope. No. I thought everyone in the Commonwealth knew about that. By <laughs> no. Now. Where the Minutemen betrayed each other and the people they were supposed to protect. I was with Colonel Hollis's group. A mercenary group called the Gunners was attacking Quincy. The people there called for the Minutemen to help. We were the only ones that came. The other groups, they just turned their backs on us and the folks in Quincy. Only a few of us got out alive. Colonel Hollis was dead. So I ended up in charge of the survivors. We never found a safe place to Damn. settle. One disaster after another. You saw how it ended in Concord? Yep. Good riddance. As long as you don't give up, <laughs> the minute you will survive. I'm not about to give up. I won't lie, that was tempting. But I can't protect the Commonwealth all by myself. Hell, I could barely protect these people. That's why I'm talking to you. I can't rebuild the Minutemen, but I think you can. Um, what about you? Why can't you lead the Minutemen? That's not who I am. I can get my men through a firefight. I can defend a perimeter against all odds. But that's not going to be enough to bring the Minutemen back from the brink. We need someone who can bring the whole Commonwealth together in a common cause. And I think you've got it in you to be that leader. I've already followed you through hell and high water, and I'd like to think I have more sense than most. 
Okay. Sure. I I'll guess I don't have a choice. <laughs> a lot of responsibility, but I know you'll make this place better. Good. Good. Welcome aboard. This is just so right, Piper so will like me, Preston. Man, and the Commonwealth. I don't actually care. Don't worry. I'll be right beside you all the way, General. <laughs> That's quite a promotion you just gave me. The leader of the Minutemen has always held the rank of General. Our last leader was General Becker. After he died back in 82, nobody could agree on who should take his place. But one good back thing in 82. about the last Minuteman is... There's no one to argue with me when I say you're the new general. Now it's your job to make it more than an empty title. Back in 82. Uh-huh. Uh oh, what out, the heck, man? Up a radio beacon to let settlers know about it. Before you know it, we'll have a thriving new farm instead of wasteland. We'll take back the Commonwealth. One piece at a that time. That was weird. That was really weird. It kind of glitched out. Did you guys see that? That was strange. Sunshine tidings. So we're going to go to the park. Or the park. The pond. Uh, and then I'm level 14 now. So... Um, there's like... Thi some things that I could definitely level up. Um, you can build stores and workstations at settlements. I think that's what I'm going to do. And then I'm going to go ahead and go to Sunshine Co-op. And... We'll get that settlement, <clears throat> and then what I'll do is go back and then build up, like, a line of shops and stuff so we can generate some money. And I believe it also helps you with... Um, Some other stuff too. <laughs> Clear enemies. Okay, apparently there are enemies here. Well, that one's dead. Oh, yeah, they're like in these little greenhouses. Most of the enemies are. It's just like ghouls. Predominantly ghouls. Okay, well. Apparently he was dead already. There's a really cool mod, actually, for this game that I think most people would like. So if you're somebody that walks like, that likes, like, zombies, like that type of playstyle, there's actually a mod to where you can make the ghouls like zombies. So they are a little bit slower moving, and you have to shoot them in the head, if I'm not mistaken, to take them out. It's a quite nice little touch. Very simple mod, but I think it's really cool, and it's a way that I actually personally enjoy it to play. second okay got them cleared uh we got anything good over here to pick up loot 
Oh, there's some food over here. Insta mash. Hey, dog bowl. Plastic. It's an outhouse over here. Anything interesting in the outhouse? Looks like some bobby pins. Yeah, seven bobby pins. There we go. It's always a good find. This door's locked. Well, okay. I think Piper has like some of the best lines from somebody that's like following you around, if you want my honest opinion. Are you dead? Yep, he's dead. Gotta take that shot glass. You never know. Might need it. Alright, I'm gonna quick save. Leather right leg reduced damage from Meyer Lurks and Bugs by 15%. Not too bad. Wasteland Survival Guide! Oh, yeah. Hunting in the waste. Permanently collect an extra extra meat from animal kills. Hopefully you guys know what that's from. All right, let's see. Pocketed metal chest piece. Yeah, I'm going to have to do something other than this caged armor. Or cage armor. It's not as good as other stuff anymore. There's like stuff that I can get that's better. So, after I wrap this up, that's probably what I'll do. Alright. So now we can take this workshop over. And this can be a... Um, a farm is what I understood about it now. Sick. Alright. Um, build and activate a recruitment beacon. So we can do that now. Crafting. Armor rank 1, local leader 2. Okay. Um, so, recruitment radio beacon, so we'll put that there, and then we need to power it, so we'll build a generator. What's that require? What one?
There we go. Alright, let's go see our boy Preston. There we go. Well, we're doing alright. That pistol right there is actually one of the best guns in the game. Fun fact. Alright. Here we go. Old Preston. What's up, brother? What's up, brother? Talk to this rambling man. I cleared out that spot you sent me to and set up a radio beacon there. That's great news. Once folks have some place to call their own, they'll be willing to help defend it. As usual, I have something else for you to look at. Of into. course. Here's where they are. I hope you can help them. We've got to show people they can count on the Minutemen again. All right, all right. All right. Let's see. How am I on? I've got some junk. I'm also going to... change yeah because I'm just like some of this stuff I'm like very over encumbered it's kind of it's kind of wild man um, let's see left right Power armor, right leg, left leg. Uh, oh, dang. Studded le leather proves damage and energy resistant. Proves unarmed, reduce additional melee damage while blocking, improves carrying capacity. Okay. Right arm. Right leg. Buttressed. Oh, I, I'm out of leather, apparently. Well, apparently this is the right leg, too. Whatever. All right, cool. All right, sick. Sick. Anything I can do? Oh, alloy metal? We'll do alloy. There we go. And we'll store that. And then, uh, let's see, brain fungus. 
was going to say, I don't need that many of those. Oh, excuse me. The dirty wastelander. Don't really think I need 30 jet. As a matter of fact, I'm not even going to carry the jet. Same with the Nuka Colas. I will keep the purified water, though. That's good health. And these mods, like, there's just a lot of little things that I had there that's just kind of junk, honestly. Like, some of it's good to have, and then some of it's just straight-up junk. All right. Um, we're going to go to the blood clinic and work our way over. And it's probably, like, been kind of drawn out for you guys. Uh, me not using the power armor, and I'm so sorry. Because um, I know, like, a big part of this build <clears throat> is working towards power armor. Like, a good set of power armor. But I think the big thing is I want to have not just a good set of power armor. I want to have enough, you know, resources to utilize the power armor. And not just, like... Oh, cool. I can wear it for this one encounter. Oh, I'm out of ammo. I'm out of fusion cores. You know, or whatever. Oh. That's a legendary rag stack? Jeez. Poisoner submachine gun. Target is, ten, is poison for 10 seconds. Okay. Okay. That is so random. <laughs> Pork and beans. Cigars. Hot plate. Cool. That's some good junk. There's a red rocket up here, so I'm going to go up here and discover this. Usually these are good to discover anyways, because they normally have like crafting tables and stuff like that at them, so... See? Weapons workbench. Here's a power armor station. See? So, for future reference, if you guys are ever out and about exploring the wasteland and you see a red rocket, it's probably best to just go ahead and discover it and do what you gotta do with it. Oh, Minutemen. Very nice. They are friendly. So oil rig. Relay tower OBB915. Let's see. Extend it. There you go.
Who knows what exactly that'll be for? Civil alert system broadcast signal, radio signal broadcast found, distress signal. Civil alert broadcast lost. What was that? I found oh, dang, man! Ah. Jeez, man. Come on, shoot. Shoot him. Why are you taking your time, man? He's sitting there gnawing on you. Save Crackers Raider's right leg. Increase the sweet spot while picking locks. Very nice. That's another legendary? Jesus. The uh, mighty hardened submachine uh, gun, twenty-five percent more damage. There we go. Yeah, man. Some of these dogs and super mutants and stuff. Ooh, they wild, bro. Area secure, General. Oh, look at that! They called me the general. They said area secure, General. Now, just doesn't that feel good? Doesn't that feel good to be called general? I mean, if you're going to have to do these stupid quests, you might as well be called general, right? It's a trailer to discover. Oh, it's a little like trailer park or something. Fiddler's Green, Trailer Estates. Okay. Let's explore Fiddler's Green here. Okay, just push me out of the way. Oh my god. <laughs> I did not expect that. <laughs> Well, I I won't lie. I actually, I mean, I kind of knew that could ha that was gonna likely happen, but I thought I would have a little more time to get away. But the game was just like, nope, you're dead. Oh <laughs> uh, well, you know, you know, it happens. Jeez. Uh -oh. <sighs> see. All right, let's try this again. I'm hoping with the sniper rifle it'll just it'll work out a little bit better where I 
And actually, before we even worry about going through it, let's just go ahead and go down here to the next settlement. We can still, um, you know, take our time and go back and check out Fiddler's Green, but how far are we from this? All right, so we got to go across the water. It might have been closer, honestly, to go from the Cambridge Campus Diner. I really didn't realize how far out it was, though. It's pretty far away where we're going, so. Yeah, because there's that one place. There, there's something out. There's something there. Why it's relevant. I think it's something to do with raiders. <clears throat> like I found a note about it. But I want to... Oh, Super Mutants. Okay. Yeah, I knew there was, like, something. But I wasn't sure what. Let's see. We can go up this way. There's a, a, a dam we can cross. Let's look up this way. I know you're behind me, Piper. You're always behind me. on that. I'm going to go across this bridge. The dam. Are you friendly? Yep. Settler. You are friendly. Hello! Goodbye! into this relay tower. Ooh, biometric scanner. Okay, we got that extended. That's good. Quick save. Alright, we're 60, about 50 paces. Put your hands up! You're joining the Minutemen, do you understand? <laughs> I'm with the Minutemen. How can I help? We got a nest of some nasty bugs just around the corner. If they don't get cleared out soon... Oh, bugs! You guys know what that means, the stupid nice giant mosquitoes. In fact, I know some folks that would love to set up there if it was safe. If you could make sure the old workshop there is still in one piece... Anyone who decides to move in later will be able to rebuild. Giant mosquitoes. I already know. All right. Consider it done. We really are grateful for the help. Sounds good to me. And now we're going to go on over here. It's not even right around the corner. It's way over here. What? <laughs> That's so far away. It's like, yeah, just right around the corner. It's like a three-hour walk if I hadn't already discovered this part of the map. Like, oh, crap. Oh, my God. Piper, I'm so sorry. Oh, jeez. Oh, crap. <laughs> um... Well, apparently, apparently, uh, whenever I, we went across that bridge, like, last week. 
We literally crossed that bridge like a week ago. Oh, here we go. Stupid. I, I missed? I didn't miss that time. I was going to be upset if I sh shot and missed both times. <laughs> oh, God. I, I just, these hatchlings, I hate them so much, man. I just, I, I can't stand them. Oh, that's the, that's the big one. Ugh. Ugh. Uh, get away, die, devil, die. <laughs> All right, three of them are dead. I think there's like two more. Maybe three. I hear fallout music. I can't hear fallout music. Blah 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 blah. Blah 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 blah. Turn the radio off. I don't want to get copyright struck. Get out of here. <laughs> All right, we got some loot. A steamer trunk. Got it. Uh, I don't want to be over encumbered. Oh, Margaret's note. Oh. Uh. Guess I'd be under junk, maybe, or miscellaneous. Let's see. Yep, miscellaneous. Mom, Russell has been gone over a day now, and I'm getting worried. We were going to wait to tell you, but we found an old holotape from before the war in the boat shed. It sounded like someone had stashed some chems in the drainage at the end of the canal. Russell thought we might be able to sell them to one of the traders maybe use the caps to buy another brahmin i'm sorry we didn't tell you we just wanted to, to be a surprise but that's the second one of those bugs we've seen today and i think something went wrong so i'm going to have a look for him don't worry i'm just going to take a quick peek and i'll be back soon margie well um you see you're all dead all of you are dead
All right. Just got to go tell them that we have taken this place, and it's all theirs. Naturally, we have to see what's in the boathouse. So we're going to pick the lock. Whoa. Laser trip wires. Yeah, we could go down the end of the canal, but I'm not worried about it right now. We can always do that some other time. All right, let's go tell these lunatics that we've killed everything. Because, you know, for them, that's just right around the corner. It's like a two mile, three mile walk. Just around the corner. I cleared that place out for you. Should be safe for your friends to move in now. Nice to have some good news around here for a change. There you go. By the way, we've decided to support the Minutemen. Oh, thanks. We gotta help each other out if we want things to get Thanks. Better. Cool. Let's go tell Preston. So he'll give me another settlement to go help. Because that's not something that I'm ever going to escape in this game. Okay. Where you at, buddy? Are you still hiding in my old house? No, in the neighbor's house. There he is. The Minutemen are on a roll. I helped that settlement you sent me to, and cleared the way for a new settlement in the process. That's fantastic news. We're going to take back the whole Commonwealth from the bad guys at this. Anyway, I'm glad you're here. Me Something too. I'm up. so glad. We've gotten big enough that we're having trouble communicating with all our settlements. It's a good oh, problem. Oh man. And I have a solution. I think it's time to retake the <gasps> castle. It used to be the men and men. We could retake the castle before my time. Well fortified, centrally located, and most important. I guess this is going to be on the, the next the time. time. That's what we're going to do. It sounds like just so we're going to take right the now. castle. <laughs> I thought you'd like the idea. So, we're going to try. Actually, I don't think we're ready for it yet. <laughs> I actually don't think we're going to be ready for yeah, it quite yet. We this. probably need to, like, level 20. And meet you outside the castle. See you That's there. a pretty pretty tough ba battle. I've almost We've almost got our power armor where we want it. I really need to find, like, a um, some more ammo for my minigun. And we need some more You're fusion cores. Mama Murphy, get out of my way, you crackhead. <laughs> you damn crazy crackhead. Get out of my way, lady. Freaking nut job. All right, let's see here. Last thing to make in here. I think we should set some traders up now. Because now we have all the local leader stuff, so we should be able to do it now. So we'll do local leader. So that's food. Um, rank two cap collector. It's bar, bar, clinic clothing, clothing. Um, hmm. So yeah, let's uh, I guess go in here. Let's start in here. Especially since the Brahmin are not coming in here, anyways. <laughs> Clothing stands. Oh, wait. I'm going to scrap that and do this. Clothing. What's the difference in this? Clothing shop. Clothing stand 10 and clothing shop 5. 
I don't know what that even means. Clothing Emporium. I don't know what the difference in these two are, but we'll do this. It's fine. Clothing. And then clinic. armor all right so armor and so now we need to find hey you're gonna run our armor shop Preston since you just like the stand around and tell me what to do and how all these settlements need my help. Then you... Let's see, who are we going to assign the clothing? Are you assigned to something? You are. Let's see. Remember, you say we're not friends, so Marcy, you're going to get you're assigned to the clothing thing since we're not friends. You get to sit and be bored in front of the clothing stand. There you go. There you go. <laughs> All right. You're tied to this place, kid. Yeah. Yeah, I was. All right. So, um, let's take a look here. The next one is meet Minimin near the castle. I don't want to do that yet. Um, so we're not going to do that. Um, what we're going to do is, let's see here. Get the latest issue of public occurrences. Talk to Sturges. Investigate Museum of Witchcraft. I think... We'll do the. We'll start with some of these miscellaneous quests, like so maybe uh, uh, search for caps at Beantown Brewery, which is all the way down here. So we can travel to the uh, Oberlin Station and then make our way over there. And as you guys seen, there are a lot of super mutants and whatnot. So there's plenty to do going into tomorrow's episode. So, but. Uh, I really appreciate you guys watching and, and playing along with us and, and being involved with the Fallout 4 playthrough. It's been a lot of fun. It's uh, quite a grind, as many of you know, that have played these games. They're long. There's a lot to do in them. But uh, it's a fantastic game, and it's, it's even better when you're exploring with others. So thank you for joining me on that. And... Uh, Make sure you guys subscribe if you have not done so yet. If you're new here, um, would love to have you guys join our community and be a part of that. We do have a Discord, so feel free to join that Discord if you would like. It's down in the uh, description below. We've got our social media like Twitter. We've got our Twitch, uh, all of that stuff. So make sure you check those out. And uh, We'll see you guys uh, tomorrow on our next uh, session for the uh, Fallout 4 playthrough. So much love. See you guys tomorrow.